Hello, my name is Drake. As you can see in front of you, I'm into flinging foam at uh, folks that are at my age. Mm -hmm. uh, you can see I'm a fan of Ad Adventure Force and Dark Zone. You can see it all, it's mainly the Pro Blasters, but looking into mainly the MK4 in this video. And speaking out on my opinion. Alright, so. Uh, shoot. I'm trying to think of something to talk about about it. Alright, yeah, the supercharged muzzle. That's a great for, uh, That's a great feature they included. I like the Deuce Pro. I don't have it. Because, uh, it's a bit bad. The Deuce Pro, I cannot like. It's trash. I mean, it's true. Okay, I mean, the uh, FPS wise and the supercharged muzzle, that's great. Completely great, but it's trash either way. Right? I like that feature on the MP4, but all I'm wondering about the supercharged muzzle is can it fit a um, scar barrel? Is that's the issue, right? You can see in the podcast, freaking, I, I watched it all, uh, went on the website, Dutch Zone Pro, whatever it's called. Kim Holt members saw the uh, blueprints, whatever it's called, of the MK4. Left some uh, rants in the uh, review section. Mm -hmm. And my that's my main issue mainly. I mean, yeah, you improved on med all of these blasters, yeah, the MK4, but expecting on the $180 price point should be, you know, better than all these blasters combined, basically. And uh, you want that uh, FPS with the supercharge uh, muzzle and the uh, accuracy that the Scarborough gives you. Mm -hmm. That's what you want. Yeah, to be a sniper, to be a sniper. Fling foam from like what? S sniping, a sniping distance would be like. 60 feet, you want to hit your target clearly. You, you, you don't want to miss from there with the, including with the new uh, Bamboo X starts. Yeah, Th those are probably going to be expensive. I might not buy those, but it's going to be a good, I'll use them until I run out. Lose them, right? Yeah. So I, I'm just wondering, does the supercharged muzzle, uh, is it able to take the scar rule? That's all. Right? Number two. Number two. All I'm wondering is... Let me think. There's no tactics on the blasters. Blasters. I mean, look. Look at the MK 1.2. You, you, you can see. You can see the side rails. On the MK 1.2. But it's kind of weak. Why didn't you do it on the MK4? It's $180, like, it's like, what? It's 80 bucks on Amazon right now. I could buy it. No, it, i seen the reviews on it. It might be bad, bad, but you probably improved on it. But where's these uh, tactics? There's no tactics. With no tactics, how are you gonna personalize Blaster for yourself without the mods, right? Yep, you guys said it's, uh, it should be, it's like a modded blaster out of a box. You don't see not modded if he doesn't have the tactics. Right? Come on, you see, you see that Max Striker over there. You see like the, the six dots on the side. That's like space to mount a Picatinny rail. Right? You see, all that space can be used. Don't waste any, but uh, it's just all flat on the MP4. No tactics, no fun. Now, I'm going to see a lot of videos of people complaining about that. It's kind of obvious. Uh, pe what people said about that, do No tactics. Not good. Uh, yeah. I mean, look at the uh, game page tree on. It's like a big improvement on the Max Striker. It's like two Max Strikers combined, but even better with Slam Fire. Uh... I wonder if you could do something like that too, on the MP4. No, oh, you, you guys said on the podcast that it looked like a Caliburn, 
uh, whatever it's called, I forgot. It's, I just saw it like two times, one today, two, one yesterday. All right. But I just forgot what I was about to say. Let me think. Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. Shut. I just forgot. This is big important. That uh, the MK4 is. Okay, let's just change it up. Let's talk about the, uh, oh, yeah, I, I, I got it, I got it. So, it's about this, the, uh, so, in the, uh, podcast, uh, it was kind of confusing when you gave the, uh, FPS readings, you know, I feel, I felt that, uh, it could have been more, uh, what, what's that word? It could have, could have been less vague, you know, I heard that, uh, you know, while I was watching the podcast, listening on YouTube, uh, Spotify, that you know, when you guys said the, uh, uh, when those two kind folks said about those FPS readings, that uh, it was like when they said like it's a uh, hundred something, blah blah blah. Yeah, the the uh, the sting would c- correct that and say two hundred. Yeah, I don't know what, what's what's about that, but quite confusing. Uh, and, you know, when they, when, when they were talking about the FPS stuff, it's kind of confusing to think 